Hi, this is Sadie Nardini, founder of Core Strength Vinyasa Yoga here in New York City at Yoga Works Soho. Um, so today for Yoga Vibes, I really wanted to show you guys how to draw your pose from the ground up instead of from the sky down. We'll use lunging pose for an example, but it really applies to every single yoga asana. So often we'll come up into a pose, let's say low to high lunge, by expressing ourselves and going for the biggest stretch and the biggest movement first. So in this case it means hips will come down, you'll feel the stretch in the hips and the leg there and then we'll reach up and use that back body and shoulders to lift us. The front body is wide open but the back body is really constricted and since you lifted with your low back and your arms and shoulders, big muscles of the outer body are gaining more tension right now. And this front hip is disconnected so it's really kind of um, compressed out. This one is over open. So you're really straining and stretching into that connective tissue, potentially too much. So instead, we want to keep these gateways open. We want to get out of that big upper body and low back um, tension and re-communicate with our core. And to me, the core is all those muscles lying close to the skeleton from the feet to the head that helps generate more power for you and more openness in the pose. So here's how I get into the lunge instead. So instead of sky down or expression first, we're going to go ground, earth, to core, then to expression. It'll be a world of difference. Press your feet down into the floor and let those hips rise up. So the hip joints lift and you get a big gateway opening in both hip joints. Then from the lift of the hips, draw into the low belly, opening the front hip more, and wave the spine long, opening all the joints along the spine for more spaciousness. Now when you come up, be careful not to dip back down and come up through that back body. Instead, press your feet down. Let your arms relax so they don't overuse at the shoulders. Let the back of your heart melt open and the low belly and front of the spine will draw you up as the feet press down. Anatomically, this is really delicious and healthy for your body. Then when the energy hits the heart, you can reach the arms straight up to the sky without over giving or stressing that outer body to do it. So you're deep in that inner body. So I'm just going to switch and show you on the other side. We can do that quickly. Inhale, look forward. Exhale. Support that low back spine, up to the belly, rise up to the heart and the hands, and exhale down. So if you try it that way a few times, you're going to feel a lot of lightness, openness, more core strength, and less tension all around the outer body, generating these poses from deep inside. Hope you enjoy your new yoga asanas. Namaste.